So I think as everyone knows, we've just recently completed uh, uh, the second uh, 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 equity offering uh, in, in this, this last 12 months. Uh, we did a, a $30 million offering last September uh, to really uh, allow us to move forward with our PFS and DFS. Uh, but then as we moved along, our excitement and, and uh, uh, the scale and excitement we have about our project made us think that it would be prudent for us to have a second equity raising. Now, the, the reasons for that are, in general, that uh, the project's getting bigger. And so there, there's a scaling issue that has to be accounted for. The second is that there are things we should be doing in order to demonstrate that this project isn't just a 20 or 30 year life project, but to really be able to demonstrate through drilling that we have a, a very large strategic asset at high production rates for 50, 60 years. And we, we are highly confident that the drilling that we're getting ready to do will, will demonstrate that. And then I think the other thing is that uh, there's increasing uh, global interest in our asset. I think people are waking up to realizing that we're onto something quite important. And so there's a, a lot of inbound interest in our uh, strategic interest. And we want to make absolutely sure that as we ramp up the scale and characteristics of our work to go to be construction ready uh, over the coming year and a half or so, we want to make absolutely sure that we have a strong balance sheet so that we're not vulnerable to taking the, the you know, first deals that are offered to us. We're going to be very strategic and careful uh, and make sure that we are focusing on the long-term interest of, of the development of this project and the long-term interest of our shareholders. One of the important things, of course, in developing a young company into an important producer is continuing to be focused on the culture of the company, uh, the commitment of its people, the quality of its people, and the people that we surround ourselves with. And one of the things we've done at uh, Global Geosciences is we've been very, very uh, uh, meticulous about the selection of a high quality board made up by very seasoned and very engaged men and women that can help us do the things that we do. Uh, and in, in addition, being very, very careful to not only find highly competent technical and financial people to join our team, but people that share the values that we have of, you know, honesty, integrity, hard work, openness, all the things that really make for a great company. And I'm, I'm delighted at the quality of the people that we've been able to bring around this, this project. And I think that the, I think that the, 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 the capital markets appreciate the seriousness with which we take these, these, uh, these, this work.